Every now and then, somebody says right to us, my drum head arrived with creases. There is a gap in the aluminium rim. Is my drum head faulty? Nothing to worry about. Your drum head is absolutely fine. Creases and small wrinkles around the edge of the rim usually occur during production when the two-dimensional foil is cut and then pressed into a round three-dimensional C profile. The vinyl is basically processed from being a flat piece of vinyl to a three-dimensional drum head. Pressing the vinyl into its new 3D shape creates these creases. Some drum head producers add heat to press drum heads into shape and avoid creasing. However, in Brazil this is not common and also not really necessary, because as soon as you put the head on your drum and tune it, the creases will disappear automatically. With multiply heads like Corino, heads with integrated damper rings or hologram heads, two layers of material have to fit into the C profile instead of one. This is why with double ply drum heads you are more likely to see creases around the edge. So a few creases and wrinkles are quite a normal thing to happen during production. This is nothing unusual and happens with all types and sizes of drum heads. The joint is the little gap in the metal rim. You'll see it on basically every Brazilian drum head where the C profile has been cut. The cutting is often still done by hand and optically sometimes doesn't quite meet our expectations. Brazilian drum manufacturers just like to keep things simple. Sometimes the joint even has a small gap or the cut edges aren't completely straight. If the joint bothers your aesthetics, simply place it underneath a tuning rod or a hook and it won't be visible. None of this has any influence on the sound, durability or general quality of the drum head. The aluminium rim is not broken and creases are not due to faulty production.